Hi, I'm Jeremy Edwards. I work for Cornwall Council in the Transportation Department. And you're a Cornishman? I am, yeah. And you live? I live in Bobman. Bobman. But I'm from Launceston. Right. Now, Jeremy, how do you feel that Cornwall is today, in your estimation? This is my, my, pers my personal yeah. view, is Cornwall is in danger of becoming um, a bit of a, not, not a holiday camp, but a, a haven for people who, for, solid, for holiday homes. That, that's my worry, is that all the nice places in Cornwall, the indigenous population will quietly slowly being moved out um, and it is becoming a playground for um, the rich, richer people unfortunately. And how do you feel that that's having an effect on the environment of Cornwall? Uh, I'd have to think about this one. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, we seem to be focusing a huge amount on um, these 50,000 50, homes. I haven't, I haven't got a problem with 50,000 homes, but my personal view is they aren't being built for um, native people to be able to live in. They're being built for people who can best afford them. Um, it's the predict and provide argument we predict that we can sell 50,000 homes, therefore we'll build 50,000 homes. And we haven't learned any of our lessons from the past when we did exactly this with roads. Um, and we found out that the more roads were built, the more vehicles we'd use them. And we stopped doing that. We were more targeted towards sort of strategic road network. Um, and I, th I don't think we've learned that lesson from, from housing. You know, we we'll build. 5,000 homes in, in Bodmin, and will those homes be occupied by people who need the homes in Bodmin? Probably not. So a lot of growth, no problem solved. Few problems solved. My, uh, I think you're going to end up with people who've got um, a very nice property in the home counties or elsewhere, sell out, realise a substantial money, sum of money, move to Bodmin or elsewhere in, in Cornwall. They've got a nice nest egg and a, and a nice property to live in in Bodmin. And yeah, where's your growth in that?